Hey there, art lovers. Welcome back to this art, the channel where we dive deep into the world of artists and their incredible artworks. Today, we're going to explore the masterpieces of Sir Alfred James Munnings, one of England's finest painters of horses. Munnings was not only known for his exceptional talent in capturing the beauty and grace of horses, but also for his strong opinions against modernism. He gained recognition and wealth through prestigious commissions after the Great War. Let's start our journey through Munnings' art with Study of Horses in Kempton Paddock. In this painting, Munnings skillfully portrays the energy and movement of the horses, showcasing his keen eye for detail. Next up, we have Exercising the Horses. This artwork captures the daily routine of horses being exercised, with Munnings' brushstrokes bringing life and vitality to the scene. Moving on to Under Starter's Orders, New Market Start, cries of, No, No, Sir, Dot. Here, Munnings captures the excitement and tension of a horse race, with the jockeys and spectators eagerly awaiting the start. In Crossing the Ford, Munnings takes us to a serene countryside scene, where horses and riders navigate a shallow river. The peaceful atmosphere and natural beauty are beautifully depicted. Now, let's explore the Suffolk Horse Fair, Lavenham. Munnings showcases the vibrant atmosphere of a traditional horse fair, with lively characters and horses filling the canvas. In Cavalry Charge led by Lt. G. M. Flowerdew, B.C., Munnings pays tribute to the bravery and heroism of the cavalry during wartime. The dynamic composition and bold brushstrokes convey the intensity of the charge. Moving on to Horse Studies, Munnings presents a collection of studies showcasing his mastery of capturing the form and movement of horses in various poses. In Study 4, The Saddling Paddock, Cheltenham March Meeting, Munnings gives us a glimpse into the behind-the-scenes preparations of a horse race, with jockeys and grooms getting ready for the big event. Next, we have Study 4, In the Paddock, Cheltenham. This artwork transports us to the lively atmosphere of a horse racing paddock, with Munnings' attention to detail bringing the scene to life. In Brightworthy Ford, with a pole, Exmoor, Munnings takes us to the picturesque countryside, where horses and riders cross a ford. The tranquil setting and natural beauty are beautifully captured. Now, let's explore, Travelers. Munnings portrays a group of travelers with their horses, capturing the nomadic lifestyle and the bond between humans and animals. Moving on to, Study of Racehorses, Munnings showcases his expertise in capturing the power and elegance of racehorses, with each brushstroke highlighting their strength and grace. In The Poppy Field, Munnings presents a stunning landscape with vibrant poppies, creating a sense of tranquility and beauty. Next, we have Epsom Down City and Suburban Day. Munnings captures the excitement and grandeur of a horse racing event, with the crowd and horses creating a lively atmosphere. Lastly, we have Their Majesty's Return from Ascot. Munnings immortalizes the royal procession after a day at the races, capturing the elegance and regality of the moment. And that concludes our journey through the artworks of Sir Alfred James Munnings. We hope you enjoyed this exploration of his incredible talent and his ability to bring horses and scenes to life on canvas. Stay tuned for more fascinating artists and their artworks on this art.